All right, what's going on YouTube? We have a Lexus. It's like LX4. No, where is it? L um, Lexus LX470. Yeah. The B8 with the, I believe, what is a 4.7 engine. So, what we're doing on this one, we're going to replace new. New water pump, timing belt, timing belt tensioner, all the goodies. So the main purpose on this video is going to be the timing marks. So before you remove the timing belt, you're going to try to put it on time. You're going to spin the engine around. And these are the timing marks right here. Look. On the belt cover here, on the timing cover here, is a T for timing. And there's a line there. On your time, uh, ta uh, camshaft sprocket is going to have an, a notch in there. See the notch in there? So I put a little marking. This is the bus bot boy right here. So you can have an idea where is the position on it. So your mark is this one. That's your timing in there. So timing in there is the right side, which is the passenger side. The left side, driver side is gonna be the same, same way. Letter T in there. And the mark in there with the incision on the uh, camshaft is broken with a little groove in there. So on the bottom one. It's gonna be on the crankshaft. Check the keyway on the crank. Let me get a flashlight. So the keyway on the crank is pointing. It's not right in the middle. It's pointing maybe like uh, what is it like like a one. It's pointing at one. The keyway in there and in the back, right there, where the uh, red paint is. That's another groove, like a little incision, like a groove. And the actual part in the bottom, on the back, is a little light, tiny dot on the right, right next to the timing belt. That's a little, uh, like a ball, like a point. So that's what the timing is. So timing in the bottom, timing in there for the crank. The way I know I'm on timing is because you see the one on top. And this one in here. So now check if you can see the, the uh, camshafts broke it. Let me turn off the light. You see this one right here, which is the, the key way, the groove. It's pointing like a, it's pointing up. And then the driver's side, same way, you see? For the key, it's pointing up. So that's the timing on this one. Uh, that's if you guys already have everything apart. Uh, if you guys don't, uh, main sockets you're gonna need is a 10 millimeter, 12 and 14. Uh, for the main 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 bolt is gonna be a 22 millimeter, which is that one there. The way I got that one loose, I have a breaker bar. Put the 22 in here, and the breaker bar into the chassis, breaker bar into the chassis, and crack the engine for wire revolution. Just pin, and that's the only way I got them loose. So, is it 22? Uh, you need to remove the brackets, covers, and this bracket here. You have to get, uh, you have to remove both uh, two bolts for the AC compressor. You go underneath, under the car, remove the oil filter, and remove those twelve, uh, those uh, two long uh, bolts for the AC um, compressor, which is uh, they're 14 millimeters. So this one has a bunch of 12 and 14. So you go in here, you remove that one, remove the timing covers with the 10 millimeter, remove this one here from the tensioner. So you have to remove a bunch of crap. You have to remove the alternator. You have to remove the power steering pump. So everything is 10, 12, or 14. That's the only thing you need. Of course, remove the housing from here. Boom. That's about it. Um, I don't know who's watching. Someone watching there, leave a comment. Again, this is live. Um, I have the GoPro here. I was going to try to record some stuff, but uh, oh, it's charging. It died. I was charging it. So yeah, that's about it. Those are your timing marks. This is mark, mark, right in there. The groove's pointing up. The group pointing up, and the crank. The keyway is like 11, and the little notch on the back with the uh, timing mark in the back. And don't forget this one right here. This is the signal for the, this is a reluctor, the signal for the crankshaft sensor. So see, it has like, 
So how it is. The one with the belly goes inside. Belly goes in like that. Boom. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a mark in there. So before I install anything, just remember. Let's put out. So I can remember. So that way. Oh, by the way, these are pretty good stuff. They a sharpie. They're like oil base. You can write anywhere, and it's pretty bright. You see the markings in there. Boom. The bottom one, bound two. So I'm gonna end the video here because we have a loud music on the background because of the neighbors. So hopefully I don't get um, you know, everything helps. Whenever every view, every time you guys watch a commercial, that helps my channel. It makes the support. Uh, get some little moolah here and there. So yeah. Hopefully I don't get demonetized because of the background music all the way in there. So we're going to cut it off here. Those are the timing marks. Thank you for watching.